Hello everyone and welcome back to Physics Radiates. Uh, today we will learn that how uh, we can draw the XRD of perovskite uh, material and then how we can label the, the peak values in the origin pro. So for that uh, first of all you should have the XRD data uh, which can be obtained from a machine so as we can see here is the data so we just need to control A and then control C so that we can copy the data in uh, the origin just we need to copy it control B okay then we have to draw the graph select both columns and just draw the line so this is actually the XRD of the perovskite uh, layer which was deposited on the FTO glass so that we can know the crystallinity the structure in also we can draw the mirror indices which maybe we, we will learn in coming videos however in this one we just need to uh, know how to draw the graph and then how we can label these peaks uh, so first of all we need to have a little bit more appropriate excess values uh, let's say i want to start from zero to for example 2800 and apply it so oh, let's say it is 3000 so it just uh, you can play around and make it uh, very appropriate or very good in vision so that you can put this data in your research article and that looks uh, good so let's say it's uh, from, for example, from 5 to 50 is okay, I think. Okay, that's great. Now take the line and borders. For example, we make it 3. Well, let's say this is on the top. No, sorry, on the bottom. So keep it like this out out is okay on the top we don't have the scale so it should be three in thickness and none there is no minor or major axis or ma major or minor text now we should go to the left make it three in thickness and okay leave it like this much better now go to the right and we don't have the data so just make it none and just draw a line so oh, sorry so, so let's say uh, go it like uh, on the right include this is three none and okay, none and apply it okay much better right now so make the size a little bit larger so that we can see it for example 3 3 is okay okay 4 is okay it's okay now make it a little bit bold let's say usually I keep it uh, 22 for my publication and let's say this is bold and I make this for for it time new romans and similarly over here 22 bold in time new roman okay so we will make this is we can do for our publication 36 time new roman okay we will call it intensity Oh, sorry this should be bold no it's okay intensity 
that is an arbitrary unit this just shows that how much is the peak or what what is the intensity and what is the crystallinity however we will discuss that later so this is the intensity and here we will keep the same font size 36 and the font style is time new roman and this is actually uh, 2 theta and for that this should be bold sorry this should be bold okay now right click on it and go to the uh, symbol okay symbol map now go to theta this is a symbol and this is okay so and the uh, this will be in degrees Sorry. okay so this is uh, our graph and we will label it uh, let's say 26 ball time roman okay and we will say this is the periscite periscite material actually it's periscite uh, xrd okay now next uh, we need to find out the peaks values what are the peak values or have so uh, just in demonstration we will have uh, high peaks let's say so we will go to the analyzer okay go to the analyzer then we need to have peaks and baseline and then okay peak analyzer open the dialog okay then we will see find peaks over here that is fourth on fourth number okay then we need to have next then okay minimum maximum it depends on the peaks values how much we have over there then we have to next okay and at this time it's okay now next and after that we need to click on find okay almost we have found uh, or here two peaks so if we want more so we should go by height uh, the threshold is 20 so let's say uh, we make it uh, uh, let's say okay it's round about uh, let's say seven okay then we will see sorry this one this is seven okay and now we have different or uh, control z This is almost 33 okay leave it on uh, right now we have this uh, these peaks uh, over here if we can see so this is actually 6.5 uh, around 6.5 and uh, these are actually related to the the first peak at the left uh, this is related to the dead iodide and other another one is actually the proper power Peroskite uh, with having some Miller indices and we will discuss that later 
uh, however this is the method that how we can uh, draw the graph of the xrd in origin and then how we can find the peaks of these uh, crystal structures so uh, up to now this is enough and in the coming videos we will see that how we can uh, find out uh, the Miller indices and then we can assign the planes of the crystal structure for the proskite solar cells so please uh, stay tuned and uh, subscribe my channel comments and share with your friends and if you have any uh, comments so let me know in the comments box thank you so much